The overall goal of this procedure is to form polymer nanoparticles of tunable size. This is accomplished by first dissolving polymer into an organic solvent and adding drug or fluorescent encapsulant. The second step is to emulsify the polymer with a water phase containing the emulsifying agent and then allowing the particles to harden in a larger aqueous volume as the solvent evaporates. Next, the particles are washed, collected by centrifugation, and lyophilized for long-term storage. The final step is to characterize nanoparticle size and surface morphology with scanning electron microscopy, or SEM, imaging. Ultimately, SEM is used to show that nanoparticle size can be controlled by varying emulsifier concentration. The implications of this technique extend toward therapy of a variety of human diseases because particles can be customized to encapsulate and deliver a wide range of therapeutic agents for sustained action in target tissue. Visual demonstration of this method is critical. The emulsification steps are difficult to learn because subtle aspects of how the emulsion is formed can have a significant impact on the properties of the resultant particles. To begin nanoparticle preparation, place approximately 100 milligrams of polylactic co-glycolic acid, also known as PLGA, into a 13 by 100 millimeter test tube. Then, using a glass serological pipette,